Do you, have you heard about the combine at all? We just paid the pro day here. Yeah. Sorry if you've been access, but what grade? What was your grade when it came back? I had a third round uh, junior committee grade, uh, with uh, a couple reviews in in the second round. What kind of NFL players do you watch that you try to, or maybe compare yourselves to, or look up to? Really, I, I I try and watch just a little a little bit of everyone. You know, I, there's not just one player that I try and pick from. You know, because everybody's great at different things, especially up there. So I just kind of watch and, and pick from different people. What was the biggest factor that went into this in your mind? The biggest factor for me was really just being able to live my dream. You know, being able to to actually play professional football when I thought I would never even pl play you know football again. You know, so it was just one of those things that. Really, really pushed me toward toward coming out, and, and my family understood that, and you know they they only wanted my happiness. Sorry, I walked up late, Jeffrey. What can you tell us about the feedback you got from the advisory board? A uh, uh, third round grade. Was that put a smile on your face, or did, were you not excited about that? And how, how, did, how did you take that? Well, you know, I, I I took it, you know, how it is, you know, very humble, you know, and I, I feel like it's on me with how I prepare and, and things like that. So, you know, anything can happen. You know, there are guys that. They get first round grades that don't always go first round. There are guys that go third round, they either go higher or lower. So, really, I just take it as a blessing to even be in there. Now you, I, know you had, I know you had a lingering shoulder injury this year. Did, did the possibility of an injury, anything like that, factor into it? Um, well, honestly, we still haven't. I haven't um, gone through much with, with my shoulder. I don't know too much about uh, how that's going to affect or anything like that. But when I figure it out, I'll put you in. Would fourth or fifth round have brought you back to Alabama, do you think? Oh, yeah, most definitely. Um, but I felt like if I was in the, in the first three, then that would that would be good enough for me to actually, you know, be able to, to get my foot in the door and live my dream. Top 100 player in the Valley. Tough, tough decision or easy? 